Blessings and greetings to you. It's Pastor Weaver coming to you with your word for the week. I'm excited about this word because uh, it just uh, has so much value in it. And I believe that it is uh, a word that uh, should be um, a character trait of us who make up the body of Christ, who say that we are believers. The word for this week is the word gentle. That word is actually found there in Proverbs chapter 15 and verse number one. And it simply says there a gentle answer, a gentle answer will calm a person's anger, but an unkind answer will cause more anger. A gentle answer. Don't don't you. I want you to think about it. Uh, How often have you wanted to just almost just respond too quickly to somebody or somebody said something to you you didn't care for, you didn't like, and it kind of rubbed you wrong. And, and you know, you want to be the comeback kid and you're going to come back and say something. But, you know, you, you thought about it and God's spirit moved on you. And instead of you responding in anger, you responded with a gentle answer. And then the other person's whole demeanor changed and how they kind of responded back to you. And sometimes people who have snapped at you or did something. And when you respond with a gentle answer, they'll even say, you know, I'm sorry the way I responded to you. I'm sorry the way I, I came at you. I'm sorry what I said to you. I want to encourage you this week. Think about how you're responding to people. Think about how you're talking to people. Think about uh, the Bible says in Ephesians uh, chapter four and verse 29, it said, let No unwholesome word proceedeth out of your mouth, except that which is good for edification. So that's not only the words that come out, but how they come out, you know. And so that's important for us to understand. And I want to say to you, child of God, we have a responsibility because we are under surveillance. People are looking at how we're responding. They're looking at the words that we're speaking. They're looking at the things that we're saying and how we're saying it, when we're saying it, where we're saying it at because of the fact. They see that we are the children of God and they believe that we should have a different character and a different behavior. I hope that's you. The word for this week is gentle. Respond gently and see what the results will be. God bless you. Hope to see you back on next week.